So I'll waste my, my idea, my concept, and then I'm gonna make sure that you guys understand that for life as well. Have the white belt mentality, always learning. Yeah. This with the white key looks sharp, but it doesn't mean that I know everything. I'm still learning, I'm still learning every single day. Done with the Cobrinho seminar. I think it's uh, something quite unique to South Africa to get guys like Kennedy and Cobrinho here to show not only just maybe techniques you've never seen, but how intense and how much detail goes to those techniques. I think it was a massive privilege to share the mat with these kind of guys um, and uh, very eye opening. I think that's the key detail. And to have the privilege to share the mat with such high caliber guys, we don't get that often in South Africa. So I think that's that's been a great deal. Man, this has been a crazy week. Having these guys on the mat with us has been incredible. Their work ethic, their technique, their pressure, just their game. Everything's been amazing. They, everyone who's been here this week has literally leveled up. It doesn't matter what level they were on, we all leveled up. The seminar has been amazing. They're great people off the mat. They're ambassadors for Jiu Jitsu. They're not ambassadors for Virginia or Pond Vessels or anything. They're ambassadors, They're ambassadors for Jiu Jitsu. And it's been amazing to have them here. If something goes wrong, I'm going to try to not, not be too specific, right? But let's give you guys the concept of it. So let's say I'm grabbing here. Guys, it's been a it's the seminar today was great. Um, it was really hot. I think we had 120, 130 people. Um, learned a bunch of cool collar drags, a bunch of cool techniques, finishes. But overall, it was more about connecting as a tribe, connecting with Cabrinha and Kennedy. Um, and then the week as a whole has been it's been incredible. Learning new techniques, getting to roll with guys who are icons and legends of the sport. And just learning about them, getting them to learn about us, and creating that connection. Yeah, what an amazing week with Cobrinha coming out here to South Africa. So many life lessons, not only jiu-jitsu skills that we learned, life lessons. One of the essential things that I took from this was being a champion off the mat as well as on the mat. So obviously being a happy character, and being a friendly character outside of the mat and being humble and having humility outside of the sphere of these martial arts is what it's about. And having patience and dedication to your art form. So there's just a plethora of things that I learned from him and watching his just his all over persona. It was amazing. What an amazing experience. I'd like to thank Richie and Chef for bringing him out here and yeah, just a brilliant experience.
Norman and uh, Rich, great coach. Great coach, and I'm super proud of you guys. Super proud to have you guys as part of the family as well, okay? And uh, today, so I'm gonna start with uh, Rich and Rum, I'm gonna call both of you guys. Tuesday and Thursday, you learn so many things. Lots of little tweaks uh, into techniques that make make the techniques work so well. Uh, fantastic guys, very approachable. Uh, this week, training with Kennedy, uh, once once again, once in a lifetime opportunity. Uh, he's very technical, wild, a well diverse uh, martial artist, and uh, it's a privilege to train with such an individual. Uh, you know, hopefully they come down again very soon. And uh, yeah, just grateful for everything that's happened this, this week. 